Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am the Grand Cat and this will be the last video we do from the SummerSlam 23 tier because as of tomorrow we have a brand new Pantheon tier which has which is just filled with big old Grand Cats so we shall be very much looking forward to that but today we are going to pro a double heroic edge, we're going to get rewards from Giants Unleashed and we're going to get rewards from Team Battleground and also the rewards from Team Ring Domination as well. Plenty of things for us to do. So first off, let's get this out of the way. We have got both of our edges, they are both level 100, they both have their 100 matches and they are both heroic. So let's combine them and see how they look. And there we go, there is our pro animation for the double heroic, the last double heroic event card of SummerSlam 23, which is of course Edge, yes, the Hall of Famer, the legend himself, Edge, of course one half of the tag team of Edge and Christian, but obviously he did significantly more than that. So very cool to see that all nice and done. Let's get our rewards from Team Ring Domination now. You can see that the team has managed to get not only the Myth and the Hartwell, but also the SummerSlam 23 Becky Lynch. Of course, if you want a good team like mine, all you have to do is join by going into the Discord in the description below and say, hey, I'm a fan of the Grand Cat and I would love to be on a Pantheon tier team that is going to win all their games. And of course, as you can see here, we also won 15,000 here. I don't know what happened to Team Battleground 2. My goodness. Yeah, it's what normal lose. What the hell? Ugh. There must have been someone that just didn't play. Very rude. They shall not be staying in the team. But let us go and claim our many, many rewards. So let's get the rewards from winning Team Battleground. This is the last Team Battleground of the SummerSlam 23 tier. Oh, we did get a SummerSlam 23 card. So we got Myth Carl Anderson. We got Rick Boogs. And it was a Hulk Hogan. Oh my goodness, I had the pro Hulk Hogan. And I got rid of the Hogan. The, I got rid of the other single Hogan not so long ago because I, I didn't need the right arrows. Ah, dang, damn it. <laughs> I eventually pulled the pro Hogan. I think the Hulk Hogan was one of the first cards that I pulled in SummerSlam 23 tier and just never got the pro of them and there it just arrived just there oh my goodness just a bit too late well let's get our rewards for Giants Unleashed anyway so this is from oh we've got Carl Anderson that was from the Rey Mysterio this one from Undertaker we've got Macho Man Randy Savage we've got a veteran pack from Cena which is a rarity draft pick Triple H and Edge. And last one was Veteran Pack against Randy Orton, which gives a rare to draft pick, the MAGA, and Andre Dat Giant. Now we have a whole bunch of rare to draft picks. Unfortunately, there's no way to save rare to draft picks, because otherwise I would love to do so, love to keep these for the Pantheon tier. Uh, we're going to go for this top row up here. Got Resume 39 Championship Belts. Got a Montez Ford, and we'll go for this one. Oh, thank goodness. We got Resume 39 pop up. The reason why I said thank goodness is because ideally I would like to. I would like to keep. Let's see here. Can I dust these without. Yes, I think I can. I can dust these without fear of getting another rare draft pool. Because I would like to keep that rare draft pick for once Pantheon tier comes out tomorrow so that we can get a Pantheon card instead of a SummerSlam 23 card. And that is the plan for that. And, well, I think that is us just about done, folks. You can see that the Something Special pack has now went on sale. And I think a few of these things may very well go on sale. Uh, the new Superstore is going to be another 16 days away, so it'll be about two weeks after Pantheon comes out that these update into Pantheon cards, which will probably be Fastlane cards. And... Well, in seven days, this one will... Well, five five days and seven hours, even. 
This one will update, so that might change into something. Although I doubt that they would give you a Pantheon card that quickly. So, hmm, we shall see. Also, the Rey Mysterio is going to swap over, so if you want your Rey Mysterio card, now is the best time to do that. And also, we have 304 tickets, so we're going to have a whole bunch of these to do. However, the rewards do update in five days and seven hours, so I'm not sure if this is going to give you the chance at getting the Pantheon cards or not. We shall have to see. I think I should be Pantheon tier on the basis that I am SummerSlam 23++. plus plus. So, I'm not sure whether I'm going to do a live stream of Pantheon or whether I'm just going to record it and put it up for you guys. Let me know in the comment section below what you guys would prefer. Would you prefer a live stream or would you prefer just a pre-recorded video that can go up and you can watch anytime you want? Well, that is going to be it for this video, folks. And that is also going to be it for SummerSlam 23 as well. Let's just take a quick general look at SummerSlam 23. There we go. There's all the cards we managed to accumulate from it, including our Shucky Ducky Quack Quack and our pro advocate Paul Heyman, of course. We also have a whole bunch of females now that took us a while to get. And... We've got rid of quite a few of the SummerSlam 23 males because we need to make space. And you can see there, we're now in 451 of 450. So I'm going to have to make more space once again. But that is going to be it for this video, folks. I really hope you all enjoyed. If you did enjoy, please give me a like, share and subscribe. And if you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification icon so you can see when more of these glorious little videos go out. And we shall see you all in the next video. Goodbye, everybody.